Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back. It is Captain Cowboy here with another video. And today we are doing the Beginner's Guide mini series of Iron Throne. So stay tuned, kick it back, relax, because I'm going to show you some extremely basic stuff. Where can I find everything that I need in this game? Well, we're going to start off, and this is our basic introduction. This is what we see in our castle. So, from the left side, we have our profile picture. It gives us our lord level in this top left corner. I don't know if you can see my little mouse. Then it gives us this little, you know, energy level. And it tells us how much AP we have. AP is utilized to kill monsters. It's utilized to kill chaotic. We'll get more into that in a bit. Below that, we have our hammer for construction timer. And we have our research timer as well. We have our VIP level, and it is gold if it's active, it is black if it is not active. Above that, we have our power level. Then to the right, we have our buffs. So we have our peace shield, which is a little dove. If it's green, it's active. If you don't see something, you need to fix that. And then to the right is just the world buffs. Every single day, there's different world buffs. We'll get more into that in another video. So within the buffs, on the very top, and the very first thing you see in battle is peace shield. You should always always see something in there with a timer then we have just different battle buffs we have different rally buffs we have different world buffs so this is going to be like hunting this is going to be march speeds this is going to be gathering troop capacity yada 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 we're going to have a appointment so this is going to be our speeds our capacity our production then we're going to have miscellaneous buffs so this is going to be vip buffs this is going to be lord experience this is good anything permanent buffs you name it we got it then we have from here, we have our resources, then we have our gold. If you click on the gold, it will take you to the shop. The shop has everything you need with different tabs on the right hand side. So you can find exactly what you're looking for. The loyalty bonus is essentially lucky draw. Then we have our event center. The event center, there's always a different uh, event going on. They have a schedule of when these different events are happening. So construction, research, tra troop training, and then on the weekends you'll see that it goes to killing troops. There's different alliance events, and you get different rewards for doing them. Then there's the battlefield, which tells you the different times till the event. So we have the town mode, the team deathmatch, battle royale, the arena, the story mode. And then, you know, we have all of our different buildings. But let's go ahead and take a look at our bottom here. So we have our chat function. We have row chat, we have one to ones, which is private messages, and then if you are an R4 or R5, you have a special dedicated R4 chat. You can click the tab on the left to switch between Kingdom Chat and Alliance Chat. Quests takes you to your different quests. Straightforward there. Your items broken up by resources and different like you know, resource like and gold um you know, resources. You're gonna have all your battle buffs, you're gonna have all of your speed ups, you're gonna have all of your chests. Then you're gonna have miscellaneous. So your experiences, your troops, your auto hunts, then you have your hero tab, which gives you all of your different equipment, your runes, your auras, and then your materials, and then the little shop. Uh, when we take a look at the map, things are different here. So when we take a look at the map, we're going to notice quite a bit. We're going to notice that I am in the middle of a burning hive. Because when you decide not to kick out a member who is harassing the entire kingdom, you just get killed. So we're going to see here, we have a map and a compass here. If we click that, it will show us the kingdom map. If we click on the little globe, it will take us to see all the different kingdoms. With a little button for kingdom transfer. So, when we look here, we will notice that there's the capital in the middle, and then there are different little symbols, which are the sanctuaries, which are essentially the wonders in uh, King of Avalon, Guns of Glory. However, these have to be held at the specific location. They all have different buffs to them, and they are alliance-based. The one that flashes give you a whole bunch more rewards. More on that later on. Then there are the uh, people steeples that you want to be doing every single day. Um, there's also the search function. You can utilize set level to choose what type you want to be looking for and the level. Or you can set auto. Same with monsters, farms, lumberyards, quarries, iron mine. 
silver mine, and historic site. Historic site gives you gold. Yes, that's right. You can literally farm gold in this game. Let me tell you. Um, and swag. I don't know. Is there anything else we should uh, mention in this little video? Nope. I think that's a pretty solid layout of where everything is. Uh, basically, anything that you really need to know, you're going to find just over the course of doing things. There's a lot going on in this game, so don't get overwhelmed with there being a lot going on because you're not the only person who thinks so. They give you a lot of options, so basically uh, you're just going to kind of fiddle around and find the things that you like most. There's only a handful of things that are really a necessity. The rest are all just for fun. Yep, and then there's the event center on your Citadel. You can just click on it. Alrighty, thank you all for watching. This is Camp Cowboy signing off here. We got my boy Swag to do the elevator music in a second, but if you want to download this game, hit me up in the DMs. I can hook you up into the playtest. What the playtest is, is you pretty much you play the game. The devs want to hear back your feedback. So, you hit Citadel 22, you give your feedback, and you get rewarded heavily. Let me tell you, can't talk about it too much. You just got you got to if you know, you know, all right? And uh yeah, hit me up. You can add me on Discord online. You can send me an email. My email is on YouTube if you go to my homepage. And uh yeah, even on the Twitter DMs too. That too. All right. Gang, take it away, swag. Do do do. My name is Swag. Do do do. Here we Captain Cowboy. Do do do. Yeah, I am. Do do. Stay tuned for part.